Hey guys, RC Bros Productions here. In this video, I will be reviewing my HPI MT2. So uh, here it is. It's four wheel drive. And it's from about mm, 2009 or 2008, so it's kind of old. Uh, here's the transmitter. It's the HPI TX2, 27 megahertz transmitter. Uh, this car is four wheel drive. Uh, it's got a 75cc fuel tank. Upgraded muffler on there. That is not the stock muffler. It's a metal one. Uh, the engine is the HPI T15, which is kind of an old, older engine. It is discontinued. Uh, it's just a single speed transmission. There's no two speed. The servos are HPI SX1 servos. So they're pretty nice. It's got a fairly nice suspension. But the shocks are general, or they're kind of more laid down generally than mo most RC cars. They're kind of, you know, at an angle. As for most RC car shocks, are more kind of upwards. But yeah, they still do a pretty good job at soaking up those bumps. Uh, it is four wheel drive, like I said. Uh, I believe it has a center diff. Um, as you can see, the diffs right there working. The engine is kind of old. I've run probably. Mm, three gallons through it, but I did not get this thing new. This came from, uh, this came the stuff that I got from that one neighbor last year. Uh, that included four other RC cars. The engine compression is it's decent. It's okay. It's not great, but it's not really bad either. If you see here, so yeah, it's not bad. It also had this, has this little plate right here to protect the spur gear, which I really like because the spur kind of sticks out a little bit right there. So that's, that's definitely a good feature to keep rocks and stuff from getting in there. And yeah, that is the review of my HPI MT2. Stay tuned for more videos of this thing coming this summer and probably recent or soon too. So thanks for watching. Please remember to comment, like, and subscribe.